Hello, my name is Christian Beers with Porsche Jacksonville. I'm going to teach you how to work the tire pressure monitoring system. When you're first greeted with a tire pressure monitoring screen, you may see a couple dotted lines next to where your tire pressure should be. To get an accurate readout of the tire pressure, you do have to travel up to about 15 miles an hour and wait for the sensors to get an accurate readout of the actual pressure inside the tires. Now, once you've traveled over 15 miles an hour, we'll give you an accurate readout of the tire pressure in all four wheels. Now, as you can see here, it's 39 in the front, about 41 to 42 in the rear. That's completely normal for this car because we do have staggered wheels with different sized tires that require different tire pressures. Using the wheel on the steering wheel, access the menu, you press in, you can see a ton of different information. If you live up north, you can change the size of the wheel depending on what tire you're running, whether you're running a full load, and a fill information. As you can see here, plus one all the way around, except for that bottom right one means we're just a pound over pressure and, and basically all four wheels. Now, if you were under pressure, it would let you know as well, but everything is completely normal. One to two pounds over or under is completely normal for our cars. Other than that, have a wonderful day and follow us and like us on Instagram.